everybody. Welcome to today's stream. A little off schedule. We're going to be doing some uh, seven star raids of the Venusaur variety tonight. I'm usually not around on a Friday, but this week I am uh, just kind of found myself uh, not going to the usual place I would be. So. Might as well get this done, since I haven't otherwise had an opportunity. From... I, I severely doubt that for a lot of these things, but... I'm gonna find it really quick. That one. Oh, I'm not concerned with uh, whether or not we can do it. I'm 100% certain that we can just kick its ass. But... So it's, I haven't streamed since the last time I did this. Um, got uh, three little additions to my fucking shiny box here from several weeks ago <laughs> while I'm on stream. Uh, three completely separate instances of shiny Skrelk. that I can utilize for things, though I honestly I'd prefer to be using a zero speed uh Dragology for any competitive uses, so I probably won't end up using them for that, but I also caught them in three different Pokeballs just because I couldn't decide which one was better. But apparently the one I caught in the luxury ball has a title, so Mark Shiny. The Dawn Mark. I guess. <laughs> Wasn't really paying attention to that. It was just, ooh, Shiny. that many marks on any of my Pokemon, so... Yeah, that that's helpful. That is super helpful, it really is. I'll probably be fiddling around with this Dragology for a team I'm working on right now. We'll see what the next we'll see what the next rule set is. Because there's like one month remaining in regulation F. I can't wait to see what I can't wait to see what regulation G ends up being. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so ladies and gentlemen, we have as per usual, a set of build that I have made for this occasion. Overkill's bringing his Blissey, as per usual. <laughs> I'm just like, mm, which one do I want to attempt? I feel like... I... Oh, what, Venusaur? Ground. Let's see. 
Mm. Candies. Yeah, that, yeah. That's the opposite of a good idea. Other times, absolutely. <laughs> Bear. All right, I'm uh, just building two mons first for that.
That not on the list because it's It is the exact same one, yes. That's the one. I, for the team one, I'm gonna try a Vile Plume. chestnut strat yep yeah i've heard about that it's i have heard that that is an incredibly efficient way of dealing with this i've been trying to not to avoid that and do other things but i know it works Yeah, that's one of the- that's the thing. I've been stuck at work for, like, the whole last week. Yeah. Basically it. Uh, let's see. Hmm. What's that? 
Hmm. That is a major thing that is uh, very much missing from this game, yep. Twenty-five. Literally next year. Literally next year. I'm just setting up my Pokemon for this very as quick as I can. All colors, I believe. Talking about figure off, yeah, no, he's pretty energetic. But yeah, it's the yeah, it's the other two that don't want to move. The middle form is the energetic one. The rest of them, eh. It's not a chance of finding out about the shiny or not. Wait, are you a ditto? Prepared, ready All for right, the late I'm gonna show. go back to the raid. I'll be there in a second. Okay.
Man, the game was looked so good until it started raining, and now the game looks like shit again. Challenges the group. Code's going out. The code is 74V72D. That is 74 vaginas to 72 dicks. That's too many vaginas. Yeah. <laughs> it's not the dick to vagina ratio is off. <laughs> Well, uh, yeah, you can have one second. You can have uh, two minutes and 15 seconds, to be exact. <laughs> Correct. <laughs> so, one thing uh, quick yeah. to note. It, you, you remember how Empoleon had, like, the one-two combo immediately at the start of the raid? Yes. This this one has a three move combo at the beginning of the raid. So I don't even get a chance to put light speed up before it beats the shit out of me. Sorta, of, kinda. Uh, it. I think only one of those things is an actual attack, but he does like three this, separate this moves before you get a chance to do McNugget. anything. <laughs> yep. It's a three-piece McNugget uh, before we even get a chance to set up our uh, screens. God. What an asshole. And also, he uh, he has a lovely uh, habit also where he uh, resets his own stats the minute the shield goes up. I mean, they all been doing that recently. No. No, they reset your stats oh. about the same time the shield goes up. It resets its own, so now it re now you have you can't redo any of your utility moves while well, the shield's utility up. Utility moves that on it. On yeah. it. Yeah. So if you're worried about like trying to bring its defense down with like metal sound or something, I it forgot ain't I, tur I turned off. I took <laughs> off my helmet. I'm mad. I'm so mad. I forgot. I have my green lipstick is out. I don't like it. Here we go. Okay. Yay! You know, I could change the rainy day. Good, but I benefit from this also. So. I mean, that's fair. You do. Pedal! Oh my god, my health bar! That was the one physical move it has. Die. Can you heal? I can heal myself. No, I mean, can you do a heal tier? No. Oh, I can do that, yeah. Uh, I died. Never mind. Too late. The poison got to me. Oh, it's already nullifying the thing. Okay. Heal is already up okay. as well. Oh, that's because of the timer lost. Yeah. Yeah, he he sprint me off the way off the bat. And then you died. Yeah, I got crit. And I got crit. Not that I had much HP left to begin with, but I got crit.
fighting it. Wow. Oh, okay. Neutral ass hits are doing half of my health. I mean, he is a brick shit health. So was, like, he's, he's there to fucking yeah. kill ya. Like, I, I can't fucking uh, accomplish much myself right now. I just move and take a myself. Helping him. I'm just doing helping hand over and over again on chestnut. <laughs> yeah. Good plan. The game's trying to figure out how to rationalize the Venusaur's dead, but the yeah, timer just ran out because of that death. <laughs> but wait. Uh, you're going in the, uh... You know what? I have a friend of all. That's pretty cool. I... Uh, when, when, whenever am I going to use this item that? Yeah, fucking Safari Ball. Fury Ball, the fucking Venusaur. Let's oh, no, wait! Wait! We can farm this for Herba Mystica? Mm-hmm. Did I forget yeah. to tell you that? I don't care, spicy is the one I want. Don't know how I'm feeling. It, part of me doesn't know how to feel about how I'm feeling about the Vile Plume strategy anymore. Just because I'm not able to tank the hits the way I thought it was going to be. But at the same time, I'm a little weirded out by matters because it was telling me that my Giga Drain was not very effective. So I'm trying to figure out why a grass type move was not registering against a fucking ground type. I don't know. That actually completed part of my Pokedex. <laughs> yeah. I don't, I don't yeah, have because the fucking uh, blueberry. Yeah, because the blueberry Pokedex has all of the uh, starters yeah. in it. Speaking of which, I think the only thing I'm shy of for Pokedex completion is a Lolan Golem. Yeah, you were hitting like a truck. Helping hand really did help a lot there too. Now the 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 chestnut strategy, from what I've seen, is massively powerful. I've heard a lot of people talking about how that's the solo strat. But once again, when I'm trying to do my builds and I'm trying to make my videos, I'm not trying to ride off of other people's ideas. I'm trying to come up with my own stuff. So. Well, I have my Venusaur now. Aim. Maybe. So, let's 
see how well solo strat works. But Raven, why don't you just use Venusaur to fight Venusaur? Because <laughs> for the same re for the same reason, I was attempting to use Vile Plume because they're literally the same. Yeah, typing. exactly. <laughs> It would just be big for a funny video, is why I said it like that. Right? His best counter is himself. like the damage mitigation is super important. So find my raid. Try and solo it with uh, my plan. Let's see, while Raven is doing that, what shiny should I go and get? What shiny should I get everybody? Watch Raven play for a minute. We're gonna we're gonna watch Raven play, and we're gonna criticize his gameplay tactics live on stream. That hurts like a fucking oh, No, Raven! I just realized something. You're, you're blocking what? your Pokemon's health, fuck! <laughs> yeah, just in general, unfortunately. I'm almost blocking something. Wow, that, that Venusaur fucked you up. Yeah, like I said, it's like, damn. That hit like a truck.
did not quite crack it with that. Can you fucking not? I got double critted in the same turn. Like, he attacked me because he is faster under the sun. Then I hit him, got most of my health back. And then he crit me a second time by attacking me again. The game said, you're not allowed. And it's like, I was literally one attack away from winning, too. Yep, you sure were. <laughs> oh, Game set, damn. fuck you. <laughs> uh, not today, Satan. Mm -hmm. Try again next time. This time, get intimidate. Oh, I have to buy it? Intimidate don't help here. Well, I now I now have a game that we can play when you uh, come down as well. I have to find mm -hmm. the DLC for it, but we can play Suica game. It came out with multiplayer. Oh yeah, I forgot <laughs> about that. Yeah, when I come down yeah. next weekend. Uh, my dad said that we're gonna have the wall, all the stuff to build the wall when you get down here. Oh sweet. Try that again, and try not to get crit this time. I mean, it did. I mean, it did fucking poison me immediately on the first attack. <laughs> well, so it poisoned not... me too, so I think that's just a thing. 
That's just what Sledge Bomb does. Yeah. Okay. For all we know, it could that could be a scripted thing. was quite enough, honestly, thank you. Very <laughs> thankfully. Gone was gone, so throw it again. I'm taking my catchphrase. <laughs> With the Gen, with Gen Pal on this one, honestly, is just to be able to comfortably do half of the shit you need to, he needs to die twice. Really? It's just, it's just the, from the beginning of the raid, the fact that Venusaur is like massively outspeeding everything. And just, you, you basically have to die almost immediately into the raid. No matter what you do, and heal che healing up is just wasting time. Huh. But then you get to a point where just before you terastalize, you kind of just have to die because there's no way to heal enough HP to survive the hit. That kills way too much of the timer and leaves you with like no space for anything. Oh, 
die from those two deaths. Oh man, I'm just stomping his HP now, but there's no timer left. idea is kind of a thing. The only thing... I, I don't think Chen Pao can do it. Damn. There goes my boat. So... Yep. But I think can... Probably Frozmoth. Full build this okay. Yeah. Who's that already?
Oh, four new players. Oh, 1080, Jet Force Gemini, Harvest Moon, and Blast Core. Holy fuck. Ooh. Last I have, I, have, I have heard of Blast Core in a long fucking time. That that has not been in my brain. Game Boy games do we got? Regular Game Boy. One new Game Boy game. Okay, what game is it? Let's find out. Castlevania Legends! Okay. Okay. You like the original Castlevania games? Yeah? There's like, what, three games in that one? Something like that. All right, let's see what the NES games give us. Hey, I'm right. How you doing? Boss. Boss. Oh, five new NES titles. What we got? We got Pro Am. RC Pro Am, uh, Snake Rattle and Roll. That's a, oh, I remember that game. Bubble, I think that's Bubble Bobble, the Japanese Bubble Bobble. Uh, I don't know what that one is, and I don't know what that one is. Amrahide, translate. Amrahide, translate. What is what is this game? Hurry! <laughs> Translate! Translate! <laughs> Kanji is hard! No, really? <laughs> Don't say. There you go, I made it bigger for you. There you go, the Kanji's. The, now the Kanji's bigger on screen. <laughs> something, no, something. Oh! I'm, <laughs> No Pico. <laughs> Why is this in English, but the title isn't? No, there's no Game Boy Advance. Uh, 
think, huh? Okay, that was the game I did not expect that they were gonna add. I guess I have no choice now but to play, but to actually play Battle Juggling him? Yeah, I'm juggling him. I'm gonna 
to do this. This game is actually really difficult. I mean, it is Battletoads. It's notoriously difficult. I mean, you're right. Game over. Is that the best you swamp crawlers can do? Turkey brains, I feel sorry for you. I really do. It's all over. I never thought I'd see the battle toads beaten. It's a sad day for all toad kind. I could do that without the initial thing. There you are.
Don't let me be not poisoned. Old fucking brain. Is there an item that you can carry that is nullified poison? Once. Uh, only once? It's a berry. Fucking, y you eat it and you heal from poison. Play. God. Yep, you're dead. Yes, I will survive this attack, and then I'll have all three sword stances, and I'll start full healing. I can still do this. Gets poisoned. Poison does just enough damage to finish off the remaining bit in my HP bar. Uh... <laughs> Fuck you. Alright, I got the display capture working again, so now we can watch Raven. Now we can both watch Raven die <laughs> in. In real time. Raven, I think there's a reason why people chose Chestnut. <laughs> mm hmm. Has to be. I mean, here, let's use the Frost Mob. It didn't work. It did. Oh. Yeah. It tanks out the majority of. It tanks out basically everything. But at the end of the day, it's just. There's no fucking damage output. It's way too slow to get going. Damn. Like, it survives literally everything Venusaur does with, like, no damage, but... It's also not doing enough damage to actually finish off the raid. Huh. Meanwhile, Shen Pao keeps getting, like, within, like, one attack of fucking winning, and then fucking just gets by something. Uh, Fence doesn't really leave a whole lot of wiggle room, unfortunately. I can't remember if it affects the thing or not. I don't know if that's a thing that's going to come up either. A Pokemon, or a, or a move, or a thing, or an item that makes you stronger if you have a status ailment. It's an ability. Ability? Or... And I can't help low roll the fucking heal chair consistently. That's not helping. So 
was either gonna high roll and fucking get OHKO'd there anyway, so. Not like it's doing anything else. It's not a spinner. Got it. Don't get to do my third sword stand. Fucking waste my last couple turns trying to fucking do that save because it just gets poisoned. Fuck. Poison fucks me, got it. Moving on. I'm done. I'm done right now. Oh yeah? You're still still doing it? <sighs> I'm in an... Nothing I've got so far is I'm doing in an ad, so all. I can't tell what's going on. <laughs> Fucking... 
It's spamming Earth Power on me for the most part. I'm doing fine against it. It fucking gets one sludge bomb off in, in the middle of that, poisons me. I'm out of heal cheer, so I can't fucking recover from the poison anymore. And the increasing poison damage just inevitably fucking kills me one extra time anyway. I ha can't get fucking I rolling with any of my fucking I have things a really right dumb now. Dumb question, and you're just gonna laugh at me. But the mm -hmm. new legendaries, the ones that came out with the other ones, the flying one and the monkey and the the the, are, are they not immune to poison? Nope. Oh. Poison types aren't immune to poison. They are just resistant. Oh, okay. I thought... They can't be poisoned, also. But the flip side of that is poison types are weak to ground. Oh, I didn't know that. Oh. So are steel types. So ground basically counters everything that is immune to being poisoned. Oh. Which, that means you can't yeah. Yep, Gimme Ghoul gets messed over. Also, it jacks up its special defense as the raid goes on, so physical hit don't yeah. do much. Oh, well. You need physical. You and... Do some escape simulator? Soon. Oh, you gotta do it again? I can. I'm not, not doing it again with what I got, but... Excalibur! Ooh. Let's go for that All last right. strat. Godzilla! Thing, which I'm not sure how well it will go, but... Godzilla mode? We're gonna find out real we quick. Some Godzilla mode in chat. God, get some Godzilla in chat, everyone. Come on.
Oh god. Zombies, why are you cautiously farting in my chat? Why? Why you farting? Oh, I understand. What's all the farting oh, for? All the Taco Bell. Fuck, it's like cabbage farts. It's burning my eyes. Stop farting in my chat! Blastoise one coming out. I think Wednesday night. Okay, so we're doing this again next week then. Right? Okay. Yes. have any suggestions for off collab streams uh because me and raven raven's coming over for the weekend next weekend not this weekend next weekend and that don't involve me wanting to murder him with penguins um mm. give us ideas because it's either going to be played up because <laughs> we can play that locally <laughs> Or if we could do multiplayer. I, I, I don't know if I'll have the money to afford the DLC for multiplayer. Um, I can't remember the name of the game. Uh, it's a weekly game, so probably not. Because I only have like $50 left in my name for the rest of the month. Back to our usual playing Fall Guys. <laughs> yeah. So. Yeah.
Okay, that should be eight out of it. Let's see if this even comes close to fucking doing anything. It's coming immediately getting poisoned. I did. Guaranteed <laughs> almost. We're gonna we're gonna find out real quick. Alright, let's give this a shot. Good luck. <laughs> Thank you. I did. And I think oh. so did he. <laughs> no? No, not a crit. He just did that much damage. Okay, fair enough. here with this build is I don't have a way to lower its attack power, so... Huh. Me getting hit is a thing. Yeah, 
think this is a no. Can't lower its attack power, so I just get shat on almost immediately. No time to build up, no time to do any of that. Just down it goes. That was my last try for the night. That. That didn't go well, so I'm going to be right back and flip my setup around and don't know whether I feel like puzzles or just fucking shooting things at this point, but puzzles. one way or the other, we'll be right back. Thank you very much.
And we're back. I will put on a new hat. Figured it out. All right, never mind. Okay, multiplayer, host game, team protocol, co-op, difficulty normal, host game, invite, show raven. YouTube, hello, 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 welcome to Escape Simulator. Hope you're enjoying uh, the videos that have been going up the last couple of days. And uh, thank you guys uh, for subscribing. Hope you all have a wonderful day and enjoy our content. If you are if you are watching this on YouTube, uh, don't forget to go to twitch.tv slash that overkill guy and twitch.tv slash Ixie Studios. Yep. The link will be in the description below. Come on down. Say hi. We stream every day. Well, I do. Raven streams four times a week. Period. He just it streams. I stream. Period. <laughs> I would say he streams four times a week, except he streamed twice this week. Wow. Well, work. Yeah. He streams. That's all we need to know. <laughs> when he streams, when he can. This isn't even, we're recording this on a Friday. This, this isn't even a normal day. Friday. Yeah. <laughs> All right, we're here. I'm a ghost. I, I see that. All right, we got a lock here with uh, a six digit code. Green, or six digit, blue, that's red. Six. Green, blue, yellow, a uh, red, blue, yellow. Yeah, so there's some color coordinated things somewhere to tell us what that's about. Oh, well, we have this these. Portion part. We have this stuff here. Wait, there's a card in here. Collect to win a prize. Okay. Okay, I found a chocolate bar. On the back of the chocolate bar, there is a nothing. Okay. Uh, it has been a few uh, weeks or months since we last played. Indeed. So, oh, this book, this book has an eyeball in it. All right. Crystal dragon eggs. box okay these all have keys on them so I'm gonna take all the magic candies out Float. Anti gravity candy swirls is what they're called. Three auras, fifty levels. Wait, there are, there's a footprint on the ground here. See this? Wait, what is 
that mean? Times 20. Oh, do I need to find... I have to come back here later. Found a puzzle. The Daily Gazer, look into the future. We know you will subscribe. Guys! Subscribe. subscribe! We know that you will subscribe! Right? We know. Talk the bars to the key. a bunch of shit in the trash can because I realized I picked up a bunch of things that weren't marked for anything. that change Aha The wizard hat on oh. it, he does a thing. Hello. I took a wizard hat off of the thing, and then you put a different hat on, and it did a different thing. Yeah. So, that's gotta be worth something. I think I have the answer to this puzzle. Requires like 
Ah. Aha! I got a second magic one. Excellent. Okay. That is so fucking smart. If you stand right here with this book, you can open it. Question is, what do I do with the magic wand? I'm trying to see what it clicks on. Maybe I put it in the dummy's hand. You know those candies that you had? Yep. Yeah, can I have them real quick? How many of them you want? I don't know. <laughs> I want to see if the wand reacts to them. That's just a chocolate bar. That's what, yeah, we have to keep the, the wrappers though. Yeah, I got one wrapper for it, so. And I, and I have two. I fed it in. You need four more. Well, how do I get it in there? Just flick it into the hole in the front. No, the wrapper, not the chocolate. Oh, part. the wrap. Oh. Two more. Yeah, we put two more in. It'll summon a thing, apparently. Okay, so. The magic wand. Uh, you want to see if it does anything to the candies. Here. Here, uh, Raven. You have the candies. I have 56 the of them. How do... <laughs> no, no, no. Not those ones. The ones that were in here. Oh. All right. I mean, they have little tags with code on them. One of which code seems to match this lock over here but Wait. i can't figure out why it's not matching up raven give me the give me the uh the hats you have i think i only have one all right give me the hat i think i just figured this, pu this puzzle out okay so the star Knees back, arm right. I now have boots. What do I do with the boots? Where do I put the boots? Put the boots on? Put the boots 
thought. Oh, something broke. What mm -hmm. did you do? Testing a, th a theory. Oh. Called the Eternal Shatter Vase. So I, I shattered it to see what would happen. Well? <laughs> it turned into a different vase. <laughs> it, it, it is a completely different color than it was. Oh, <laughs> that's so, funny. So I'm like, I, and it, it, it's mentioned as like a as a clue. So I'm like, something about smashing it'll do a thing. What so it blue, does? Green, 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 red, red. What does that mean? I don't Can I know. Get those candies back? Is sure that they seem to apply to this lock back here? They could also apply to this thing here with the hats. Which I already... I don't think they do, of... because it doesn't quite match up visually. Oh. I it... kind of brute forced the hat puzzle anyway. Yeah. So, I know the lock down here mentions the blue one, the pink one, and the orange one. But the only thing that says Lippus... The only one that has Lippus on it is the blue one. So, I entered in that number, and that didn't do anything. Okay. Can I see them real quick? I'm zoomed in on them, Kurt. One of them oh. currently. Yeah, this says it's twelve hundred. Yeah, that's not the color it asked for. It's yeah, you know, Oris and Kunis doesn't say that. Orange here, the last thing doesn't say Lippus either. The blue one, on the other hand. Okay. It's the only one. That... Add the two. There's two of them that have Lippus. No, but the other one that has Lippus isn't mentioned on the tag. Like the only three that are mentioned are the blue one, the pink one, and the orange one, and neither of those say Lippus. It's the yellow one that says Lippus. Maybe it's... the order of that. stick these candies down here. Can't for the life of me figure this out right now. Okay. Alright, well you have my wand. You have the I two have wands. Both, yeah. Yeah, so you try and figure, figure out, out what those, those are for. Yeah, and I'm gonna take these candies. There's only five of them, right? Yeah, there's only those five that we've found so far. Okay. Wait. I got it. Come here. Come over here, Raven. I need you to do some math. I'm not good at this. Oh, uh, yeah. Look, here's the pricing oh, chart. Oh, okay. I didn't even see this. So that so, would be the okay. one. Okay, that would be the answer. The answer then. Okay. Hang yeah. On. I so need to pin the, this. Here you can have this. Yeah, I'm gonna this, take these back and again. Then, and I will sit here, and you tell me what I need to put in. Okay, so we got. It's blue. Yeah. With the so. Line through it. Yeah, blue with the line through it. Says. Swirls. Yep. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. I know which ones it is. I'm just trying to. So. So right now, uh, first and foremost, I guess, 
You're gonna need to put in, uh, make it 1479. Right. Then. Add 700 to the number. Alright, so it's 2079 now. No, it should be 2179. Oh, 21, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, it is, yeah, sorry. Okay. Yeah. And the other one is. Add 900, so it should be 3079. Yeah, well, that's all the numbers added together, so it's not just an adding thing, then. Thirty-five seventy-nine. There we go. Excellent. Okay, my number was off. That was another wrapper. Another wrapper. That's one more. All right. That's the. I think that's the last one. No, there's one more. Yeah. What the boots? Self-walking boots. I don't know what they do. Oh wait. I'm an idiot. Yeah, yeah. Of course I know what they do. Oh, do I have to follow it? Wand for a second? Me. Wand is not interacting. Let's try the white yeah. one. I want to know. I want to see them for a second. I want to. This was just a regular wand. This one is also just a regular wand. Okay. It like repairs itself. It's kind of funny. Yeah. Thing that thing had was just a uh... where are where are these yeah that's Remember? what I'm trying to hammer out like it's the, it's the Maybe those things are moving got the thing up top there yeah I noticed that that's why I was looking at the red, blue, and green things on the fucking locks. I was like, the fuck? Is that related? Oh. Ha 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 ha. I think I understand now. Uh, oh. I know what this is. I can solve the glove. It's the vase. Oh, cool. That's what that's for. Green one is... Old. Uh, 
head one. Looks like that. Blue one. Love of need. All right. That. Can it do anything with the with the floor, the potions? Not so far. Okay. Maybe put the wizard hat back on. Actually, let's do it. The wizard hat thing was for the boots. Yeah, but the point is, like, it's got its hand sticks out, so I'm like, maybe you stick the glove on it, and it does another thing? No, they were, it was position-based for the, for this oh. thing. Oh, alright. So, the different hats were the positions of where the lock needed to go. Which is kind of funny, because I just brute-forced it. Because I didn't have the first hat done. Yeah. <laughs> Can I see the gloves for a second? Oh, you're doing the thing I was about to do anyway. Yeah, it doesn't seem to be interacting with anything here. What about uh, with um, this door here? going between the potions on the ground. It's really annoying. I'm trying to figure that out. Can I see the gloves for a second? Sure. Ah, I got it. Figured oh, is it there something on the glove? There, I twisted the glove around and it gave me the, uh... Oh. Ghost map. A ghost map? Ooh. That was okay. spooky.
Oh, wait. Okay, so he... The first thing he did... which is mannequin or pumpkin could be pumpkin okay that's it figure it out okay so we came over here candle. looked at the candle he went over here which was the immovable pumpkin he went over here which is book Here, which is candle again, and then just cycle through this one. Oh wait, no wait, this could be. Oh, I could be going the wrong way because it could be cauldrons. No, because he starts here. Oh no, he does start here. Oh, it does. Oh, I'm an idiot. There. Well, this obviously is a different one than the other one. <laughs> okay, so that's that's important. I think this one's related to the fucking boots. Oh. Yeah, it is. What is it? Number into each individual thing? How many steps he's taking? Probably. You tell All me. Right. I will in a second. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. One, two. Oh, there's a separate dial here. There's a number of steps, so there's also a, a sun symbol. The sun symbol is where he starts. No, there's three different sun symbols in between each number. Yeah. Oh, it's probably covered up by that shit on the floor. We had to clean the floor to be able to see it. Yeah, I guess so. Okay. Next thing's well, finding something that can do that. And this is... Wait! I'm an idiot! You got a mop or something, didn't you? You fucking did. Okay. The first one he walks through is the one that looks like a razor blade. Uh, yeah, saw yeah. blade, then like, then like, saw blade with, with finer teeth, and then sun. I 
skip. Oh, there we Another go. I need one. that one. I need that go. one because it's part of the puzzle I'm doing. There you go. Thank you. And I have another one. Here, Raven, have some chocolate. Yeah. Alright, so wood quality. Lighter types of wood are more common. Like how low quality and cheaper uh, white while darker wood types are more rare and higher quality. Wood cores, stars, sparks, and lightning. These are three types of wand. I can't read it very well. I wish I could read it better, but nope, can't zoom in any more than that, can I? These are three types of wood cores, each one producing a different type of effect when casting. Cast a generic growth spell on power greeting. Weak wands, binds reach lowest circle, strong wand. Oh god, what just happened? Why is my game being all weird? Okay, so this is just a dark one with no core. Raven, I can't do the puzzle! <laughs> Son of a bitch! a second book or something. Cast a generic growth spell to power greater weak ones vines grow lowest circle. Huh. Oh right, this is a level two wand. Okay. Now I get it. Oh, that's so smart. This is a level one wand. This is a level two wand. This is a level three one with a lightning core. So lightning, level three one lightning core goes here. Uh, I don't need this anymore. a level 3 one with another lightning core. I think it's a lightning core. Stars, sparks, and lightning. In their charts, it looks like one direction is levels of lightning, and the other one is number of branches. Oh. Right, then this goes here. Does this have any lightning at all? This is stars. So stars is this one, and this is level two. Yeah. So... Okay, I get it now. Oh my god, I got it. Okay. Lightning three. Okay. What is that? Are these sparks? I guess so. One sparks. So, one sparks. There. And then this one is... Lightning three light. Aha! All right, now what is this doing? I think I gotta find something that this works on. Demystifying lamp. Oh! There's something here, Raven. 
Oh. moon there. What is this for? I wonder. Oh! Yeah. That's why I had the hat. Oh! Not that the hat snaps to him or anything. Put the glove on him, maybe? Nope, I tried. Oh, I put the glove down. Didn't want to do that. I move this like this like like that <laughs> there's definitely like something on the ground that we have to follow because like there's a planet here and then like there's like a trail that leads to this chest oh, this box can we move it yeah oh we sure can. can oh follow the ropes okay where did they go? Yep. All right. So this one goes. Ah. The first one is, uh, is moon. The moon. That would be awesome if I could still yeah, see I them know, after I, you left. I, I know. Believe me, I know. I need to give her this book. That's annoying. All right. Yeah, second, second one's one. over here. Nope. It goes no, it down. goes down. And goes over here, and it's the full moon. Full light moon. Oops, wrong button. Third one, this line, that one is going back up, apparently. There it is. Oh, right here. It's a, it's a half, half moon. moon. Okay. I got a wizard hat! The new hat. All that work for a new hat. This guy wears, apparently. And then. He hold. Oh, oh, he's pointed something. He's got something. Up. Oh. He has something in his hand. Oh. Bird cage. I got a key. The ethereal escape key. I mean, I can use the key here. Yeah, baby! Woo! All right, next episode. Hey, do the Chronomancy Hall. Oh, this is going to have time travel in it. Ooh. All right, well, guys, you're going to have to see that in the next episode. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Right, hello everybody welcome back to escape simulator don't forget that if you are watching this on youtube don't forget to go to twitch.tv slash that overkill guy and twitch.tv slash ixy studios and give them give us both a follow thank you so much and enjoy our shenanigans i found a key what does this key do Dear Apprentice, don't forget, in times of need, time is your biggest ally. I've enchanted two, two staffs for you. The time staffs 
My masterwork. One will cycle time forward, the other backwards. They are not yet perfect. They only work on objects that have very visible magical aura around them. Good luck. Time has to go backwards on this. Diamond to star. Oh. Hey. Okay. This, I just changed the sign to, and it added an arrow to it. No, you picked up a thing that goes on this board. I, what thing? It was in here. Oh, the clock thing. Yeah. Yeah, it goes in on this board somewhere. Does it? So just. Oh, yeah, sure does. Oh, I yeah, can, so I can literally place it on any number. Yeah, yeah, just. Just place it there for now so we, we have oh. them there. Oh, well. Now they're wait. reacting to each other. Wait. They want to go, okay. They want us to move in that direction. Sitting on the 25, fine. That wants to move to, thir that wants to, move to 12. No, it was comfortable at 12. So that's where they're supposed to go. Okay, well there we go. We now know what that puzzle's about. So that's two of them anyway. I assume yep. we need more of them. Yeah, probably. I'm trying to see if there's any more candles, because apparently this is the candle puzzle that we're up where the, the lines of the candle need to make be flat. Also they have an aura around them, which means one of the staffs affects them. Oh, is that what that's about? Yeah, I've oh, got... Oh, I don't know where the key goes. Oh, cool. Hey, do you have a? Do you have another hang key? Hang on, hang on. Put that key down. Yeah? Can you, can you reverse time on that key? No, I can only fast forward time. There's another staff that uh, reverses you put, can, it. Can you put the key in that key that you have in your hand? Can you put that in here? No, the other one thing is that not a key. The thing that's that you a your hand? giant staff. Oh, it looks. Here's so your key, by on the, the way. Preview. It's okay, a wand awesome. staff. He's on the floor, by the way. All right, cool. Sigil lockbox. Oh, I have to find the sigil thing, apparently. Oh wait. Hey, can you say you can go forward in time, right? Yep. Can I you made go a butterfly. In... Oh. Apparently 
that's important. Oh. Something. Let's put it back in the thing for now. Still got it. Oh. <laughs> I can throw it. Let me try and do something. No, it's stuck where it is. Okay. I can. Can you, uh. Can you re can you forward time this uh this thing here? I can. It wasn't doing much except making the thing turn faster. It makes it th that one thing turn faster, see? I think they're missing pieces. I know, but I'm just saying. I want to now know. I now know that you can move that. Uh... I've been playing around and testing it out. Anything that's got the little aura. Though sometimes the aura means that it can go backwards, but not forwards. Something goes in that bird's mouth. Same over here with the dragon. I fast-forwarded this, oh, uh... What? Oh! What? Yeah, you can change the colors. Green it is! Also, this uh, statue over here is apparently a key item. It cannot be picked up, but it, it's a key oh. item. This one also is a key item, too. Oh. Eat. So. Wait! If that's a key item, it can be moved. It can go somewhere. Right there. Raven? Yep. Oh. But it has to be at a specific time. Yep. Sure does. What's the time? Oh, also, by the way, this painting over here I can affect, and it's, uh... Change it from one season to the next. Huh. Gotta find the other staff to be able to interact with some of the other things. This is, uh... Oh, this also does... Alright, well, I'm gonna leave that there. Candle puzzle probably requires uh, the four, the time backwards staff to get the candles back to their heights or relight yeah. them. When I do it right now, I can shrink them with mine. Oh. But I can't, like, make them taller. Okay, well. So the uh... other staff is required for that, I'm sure. Yeah, probably. Oh, okay. Hello. I can solve this box. Um. Oh. Interesting. Here's the other staff. I can now reverse time. Let's go. They're all supposed okay. to be the same height, right? I guess so, yeah. And Keep lit. Them all. Oh. Yeah. They look very phallic when they're growing. Right? I don't like it. I don't like it. Okay, so I can forward it then on a couple of them and make it even them out, or you can even them out now that they're lit. You gotta mix them around until you get them both evened out in height because with the stand. There you go. The Just, um, uh... Oh, wait! Uh, Raven! Raven! What? Fucking reverse my key, damn it! Oh, yeah, I can do that now. It's now a fixed key. Now I will go. I have another echo crystal apparently. I don't know what it's for, but I have one. Wait, can it go in the first? So I fixed I fixed the owl statue over here, so it can be used as a key item for time thing now. All right, hey, reverse this. Yeah, well. because I forwarded it before and it just uh, didn't do anything. So let's see if there's anything hiding at the bottom. 
No. No, but it did. Does I need. Have lines? Yeah, the sand needs to be obviously at a specific level for something. Well, Raven, reverse the time on this uh, mirror over here. Oh, I I put it forward before, and that's why the arrow's there. Yeah, but go the other way. See what happens. Oh, yeah. Ah, There's a lot. It. There's an order. Okay, this is the first one. Moon to Pyramid is the first one. Yeah, but I don't know where that what that means. Yeah, this is <laughs> this is the code for something. What happens if I reverse time on Wait. this guy? Moon? I'm trying to throw pyramid. it down. Wait, go do it again. Moon to pyramid. Yeah, the moon to pyramid is the first one. Yeah. Pyramid to diamond with a mini diamond in it. Okay. Di then, then that diamond with diamond to star. Got it. Here you go. It's for the sigil oh. thing I had. That was an apple. Uh, make the apple rot, I guess? The apple's already rotted. I'm gonna try to put it back. Oh, See what put happens. it back, yeah. It's now glowing purple. Drag the cat around the clock, it says. Oh my god. Reverse time, right? You can. Now... I can reverse and forward. Yeah. What does it do to the painting then? Probably puts it back the other way. Yeah. I can literally turn it to any of the four seasons. Yeah. We we'll keep keep going. Oh, I guess it doesn't matter, huh? Yeah. It just turns it back and forth between the four seasons. I'm sure there's a specific season it has to be at for whatever. Yes. This is Escape Simulator, uh, RJ. I got a bunch of crystals and I don't know where to put them. They don't go in the middle. They're called time echo crystals. Put one down on the table, see what happens. Can I do anything with those? No. no it doesn't yeah. have an aura, so I can't do anything with it. Yeah. I, I do have this apple I've regenerated that's for something, I just don't know what. I also have a piece of paper here you might want to look at. Oh, okay. Oh, some diagram of animals? It looks like it's the clock. Because all the animals go on the clock somewhere. So where is the cat, the rat, and the owl on that, on that ring? The rat... The rat is at uh, five. The cat is at four. The cat is at four? Okay. Yeah. And what about the owl? Is at nine. Uh, nine is this one. Oh. Aha! Something is happening here. It's dropping the table parts. <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> well, you can put stuff in now. Which is dropping more table parts. And now there's a guy standing over there. Oh! Uh, Raven, put the put the hourglass at the second line. Oh, yeah, I see him. Yeah, the second line from the bottom. Okay. Okay. 
Yeah. All right. Where it's at. Yeah, that's fine. It's fine. It's probably just something we're missing. Uh. Oh, what if I just. Oh, 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 and then. Camp some make sort a, of fire? Make, make a fire somewhere. Fire pit. But that, that is. Oh. Oh, and then he. Oh, oh switch. Put, yeah, oh. switch the stuff to the yellow. There it is. Okay, and then. That's the hourglass. So it's just the fire now. This. Guys. Oh, change this to have a fire in oh, it. Oh, winter. Not trying right to in. throw it. Right. Trying right. to interact. <laughs> That's not winter, or at least it doesn't That's have a fire. Spring. Yeah. Not a matter of trying to make a fire. It's like, why would he be standing in front of a fire? Well, at any time, you don't need. All right, we'll put it there for now. Cause that's done. We haven't gotten a puzzle complete from whatever the fuck this part is, so I don't know about the- Oh, what's that? Oh, what the fuck? Different. There it is. What did you do? I clicked the fucking switch that completed it. I got oh, and... two- I got two crystals and one of the chest dials. I put the chest dial in. And you said two crystals? Oh, uh, put them in the mouths of the, on, of the dragon and the hawk over here. Or at least give them to me. Hang on, I got it. Dragon crystal. Dragon That's lifts loud. up. And there's a puzzle. Same thing. Wait. Oh, these are upside down. Oh, I see. You can move things. Okay. R, L, S, R. This, this. Uh, F is this. L is this. It's an upside down L. Upside down F. So then it's this way. L, which is this one. And upside down L? This one. Five. Oh my god. And then I'm guessing this is just zero. that one. Oh, and there you go. Yeah, figured it out. And that beams something into the middle again. Oh. Oh, there's uh, an aura. Time. There's an aura. Yeah, let me yeah. just... Okay, fast forwarding doesn't do fuck all. What about... No? What about Either putting the staff... What about putting the staff in? 
like getting rid no, of No, it doesn't. Neither of them react to it. Uh, See? Anything? I guess we do need to complete this puzzle then. Yeah, we need that other dial though. Yeah. Have you collected any more of these things that go on this wall? No, I haven't found any more of those at all yet. But what did that mean, though? So we have 25 and 12. Oh, wait! Maybe that's what this is. No? 12, it does, they did say clock frame. 12, 25, so 12. Maybe. And then 25 would be there, so it's moving the hour hand too. Yeah, no, I know. I can move both. It's just a pain in the ass. Yep. If oh, that might be what it's is that all it's for. I think I have it backwards. I think this is the hour hand. Small one's the hour hand. Forward it, or you just move it. One or the other. It's time. Yeah, it's a clock. Okay, wait. Um, can you fast forward or reverse I, the? Nope. The, the two staff don't interact with this table at all. Oh, you have to play with the sun position. Make a specific time, I think. Yeah, that. Oh, I'm so smart. Okay, well, that looks pretty exact to me. Oh, I got one. So I was doing it right. Just not right enough, apparently.
ね。Gonna have to do a fair amount of tout on that, I think. Uh, Not that far. Oh! Bring it back in a little. Oh! Right, wait, it's both of them combined. There you go. This goes over here. Yep, right on the podium. Which then gives us three pieces of thing here, and a shit, and a thing. Rotate. Oh. Dialing the fucking Stargate, man. What the fuck? What did I do? What do I do here? I don't know. There's... I don't know. This button, uh... Okay. What is that symbol? What do these symbols mean? It's the first thing. There's like some combination you're... Oh. You can take them and drag them, apparently. That's the wrong one, but now we know what we're doing. Kind of. Wait, do we have a piece of paper for this? I don't. I just have the initial note. Can I see it? It's just talking about the time staffs, but yeah, sure. Oh, it's a note, like an actual... Yeah, note, <laughs> note, yeah. What about that piece of paper that had the, um, the, the, the animals on it? No, that doesn't have anything like that. And then there's a... We have a weird butterfly that we don't know what that's for yet. Yeah, we do. Oh, the well, butterfly was the code dope in this box. Oh, okay, okay, I never, I didn't, I didn't, well, it wasn't part of that, so... Yeah. Oh, I think I understand. Do you? Let me play with this a little bit. I'm pretty sure we're supposed to try and use... We gotta combine three of the symbols on the board to make the same symbol in the middle. I think. Oh, you're right! Pretty sure, yeah. So I think that X is definitely, and then that single thing over there is probably another... It's probably but, this one? Yeah, I'm thinking it's the top... The X on the very top, the straight line on the side, potentially. But that this one doesn't well. give us the top and the bottom at all. I think it's this one here. I think this one no, here is that's, one of them. No, that doesn't have the right thing. That's got too much piece on it. Thinking realistically, it's the 7 and the upside down 7 are for sure part of it. And then the straight line, I think. Be this one. This one? Hang on, I gotta. Can't fucking get at it from there because of all the shit in the way. I think I can move things though. That's the first one. I have to move it now, huh? Yeah, that's fine. No, it's not. It's, that's yeah, not it is. the correct one. Yeah, yeah, watch! Oh, I don't think you seem to understand the problem. I'm oh, having. I got it! 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 Yeah. You, you... Okay. I'm pretty sure it's the seven, the upside down seven, and the straight line. No, not that one. Yeah, because you uh, no, because you it automatically goes. No, no, no. I know. I messed up. I wanted to go the other way. I wanted to go here. And then that's no? not the whole thing. You can only combine three. Oh, you're right. You can only combine a maximum of three, and the minute it combines the three, it's done. That's why I'm saying it's the seven, the upside down seven, and the straight line. It has to be. 
Oh yeah, you're right. I don't think any other combination works. And it just resets them, but you can't get at those three without jumping it into some... Oh, you can shift it. Okay, that's why. Make it so there's a clear path. So I need the seven. Yeah, the upside down seven. Oh, okay, now I get it. I have to back up a little bit. It's going to get really hard to see. So I need the seven to be here. And then... It, this is the one I need? How do I get that one? Hang on, let me add this again now that you've moved it around. No, well, hey. no, you can keep moving it. Probably into the door over here. I think that was probably the last puzzle. Yeah, there it is. Woo! All right. So it finished. All right. See you guys uh, in the next video. Mm hmm. Potions Garden. All right. Hello, everybody. Welcome to episode three of. Escape Simulator, Escaping the Magic Kingdom. Uh, yeah, Just waiting for it to load. And isn't it great having a computer that doesn't crash when you play? Yes. <laughs> hey, look, I found something. Raven, here, take these. Take these back. Alright, and then use this. You keep this up, Raven, I'll stab you! <laughs> I got a knife! Here, have a knife. That's a beehive. Yeah. I found some more things for you to use. I found you more things to use for your potion. Excellent. Oh, wrong button, wrong button. There we go. There's another one for your potion. <sighs> this guy's angry. This guy's sad. This guy's happy. Here you go. I found you another thing. I'm just throwing stuff over there for you. Yeah. Oh, I found you another thing. <laughs> uh oh, I've let the butterflies out.
flower that plant that attracts only bees. Oh, did you put that in there? I put nothing in anywhere. Okay, so at the end of this, it needs to have plus three plant, one, three plant, one water, nothing else. the cauldron i mean go for it i just wanted to put three things in oh you actually just need to like throw things in okay yeah and then they regrow if you fuck it up so it doesn't really matter cool Size potion. Alright, and now I need to make the flower of the plant that only attracts bees, flower of the plant that only attracts butterflies, flower of the plant that attracts butterflies and bees. Question. How did you get the plant to grow here? I didn't. Oh. Because these plants are the answer to the box over here. Like those four things, if grown, spell out the code for this lock. Okay. Well, I didn't grow that. Yeah, I thought you did based on what I saw. I'm but... trying I'm trying to get the fertilizer to grow stuff right now. But I need to get the plant that attracts bees and I can't get the bees to come out of the fucking hive. Something with that pin. I think the pin locks the beehive. There's no way. Oop, wrong button. Oh, also wrong button. Nope, wrong button again. Cool, cool game. Go there? No. You go here? No. Here. It's a second pin. There's a second pin? Yep, got it. Or you have to do something to cross them over, but... Alright, well, I'll hold on to them for now. So I can figure out what to use them for. You attract... You 
attract butterflies? Nope, you do not. Do you attract bees? No. You have any more fruits or anything in your inventory? I do. Alright. No, uh, don't put them there. Don't, no, ah, uh, no, come to, just, uh, yeah, there. Do you attract bees? No. Do you attract bees? No. Do you attract bees? No. What about the star fruit that I threw? Yeah, I have you that. Pick the... Right here. Yeah, I need that. Do you attract bees? Okay, you don't attract bees, but do you attract butterflies? Yes. Okay, so this thing attracts butterflies. Okay. So that's important. We have one thing that attracts butterflies. Wait, more beehive bins. bins. Your star fruit is now big. Why would you do that? Because I can. Raven! I'm gonna make this flower big! But Raven, why would you do that to me? I, I can make what I, need to do. I can make things big. I just realized what this is. I just realized what this is. Okay. You go there. You go there. You go there. And you go there. Okay. I can increase and decrease their size. No? Oh, and they have to be in a very specific order, too? Oh my god. Okay. So then that goes there like that. And then this one goes over that. You did. And, and then I ate. And then I ate the whole. Okay, I have unlocked the bees. Stop making all the things big. No, <laughs> they're gonna be huge. Make everything massive. It's all growing. If it glows, it grows. Okay, do you attract bees? You don't attract bees. I think a plant that attracts bees. Raven, I have a fucking knife. I'll use it. I swear, if making them big actually fucked up the game, I'm gonna be so mad. <laughs> Look, that wouldn't have been the first fucking puzzle of the entire game to get this if it wasn't needed for something. You're right. Fuck you. <laughs> and you have no other fruits in your inventory? No, all I got are mushrooms right now. This is this is the one that attracts butterflies. Butterflies are attracted to that. So that's very important. This one doesn't attract the bees. And I need something that attracts. I need a flower, 
of the plant that attracts only bees. Mushrooms don't matter. That one doesn't attract bees. So that just Found it. All right, now does that attract butterflies as well? No. All right, so we have two things. Now I need something that attracts bees and butterflies. It says a flower. It has to be a flower, not yeah. a mushroom. That makes them run away. get a key by any chance no okay hey where'd my mangrove plant go i got him Trial and error, I guess. So, in this specific order, tracks bees, which is this one. This one attracts butterflies. be something I gotta do to get him to come down. Oh, wait a second. 
second. You are attracted to that. Are you attracted? Are the bees? At, are you attracted to this? No. You're. You are attracted to that. Are you attracted to that? Oh, I'm an idiot. Oh, I get it. Okay, so this one. These are attracted to this, right? Yeah. Okay, so this is second. Uh, you are attracted to this. And you are attracted to this. So that goes there. And then you are attracted to this. Okay. So it goes this one. I get a free potion out of it. Unless Raven steals it. I might. Oh, failure. Or it doesn't work. What? Oh, I did it backwards. I'm an idiot. Okay, this one is the one that is attracted to and just both. bees. No, this is both. So this is the third one. This one is the one that's attracted to only bees, right? Number one, this is number three, and then this is okay. the one where this is butterflies. Yeah, okay. There we go. Now I got it. This goes to this one, then this one, then this one. Growing potion, yeah. One, One seven, seven five, five eight. eight. Yep. But not in that order. Uh, eight. Wait. Which one's the lowest to the ground? Lowest is eight. Yep. Highest. Highest is five. Okay, uh, second lowest. Seven, then one. Oh, these aren't keys Seeds. at all. Seeds. Oh, where do they go? Into the pot. Oh, well, you have to rip the tops off of them and everything? No, they don't go in the pot. And then they go in some pot. They definitely go in some pot somewhere. Wait, this is a this carrot is a key. And this carrot is a token and this this was a token. All the mushrooms are keys. No no no! Raven! Yeah. It's literally Oh, a there's key. like an actual key in the package. It's oh. a carrot. It's a carrot in the shape of a key. Right on the door. No, no, no. it's a seed. It's a seed. I have oh. to throw it. Check all the pots and little planting areas. That's what I'm looking. You don't put it there. Very, oh, there I go here. Can we get rid of this, this shit out of here? Sure can.
That was a key. And then this is an actual key. Oh. Not actually. I mean, it's the shape of a key, but it doesn't yeah, go Try it on door. things. Obviously, there's something here that we're not... That is the keyhole. Yep, hang on. Yeah, I can. Big key. Oh, fire. Uh, I have a, oh, wait a minute. Can you make this ladder bigger for me, please? If That's it, great. Can I? What can ladder? You make it bigger? Uh, oh, I sure can. Thank you. I'm gonna go grab my little buddy. Yep. It's okay, buddy. I'm coming to save you. Eventually. Oh, maybe not. There's just too much stuff on the floor. Oh, come on. Maybe it doesn't go there. Rain cloud potion. Rain clouds keep dropping on my head. Whisper Willow, Pearl Petal, and Soul Vine. Oh. I got my, uh... Duplicate Potion. There we go. Can be used on objects that emit a heavy magical aura. Duplicates them once. One ingredient from each class is needed. Flower, mushroom, and aquatic. How do I know what's a potent version of it? Does it burn? Oh, you're very happy. Oh, you're grumpy. Oh, Grumpy, so you 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 do you you go here. Yeah, I got a nose. I wonder where it goes. Raven, yeah. make my nose bigger. Oh yeah, where's where'd you put it? Um, it's on the ground oh, right here. All right. Get in the statue! <laughs> what a schnoz. Oh, he's got ears missing also. Yep, we need to get an ear. Ears. Also, the miniature one also is missing parts. Oh, for fuck's sake. Really? You can pull the nose I off. It... I, I, need to I need to shrink it first. How do you shrink it? You have a shrinking potion? It's the same potion. It just goes either way. Also needs like a book or something to hold on to. Okay. Hang on, this is. Wait! Uh, oh, I'm... I need the duplicate potion to duplicate the nose. Yeah, that's the one. You know how to make that? I need a potent version of everything. Can you make this heart bigger? Sure. Oh, wait a second. This is trippy. 
There's something in the water, but there's it's reflecting. Oh, don't worry. I already picked all that stuff up. Those are the aquatic plants. Oh, I need one of them for the duplicate potion. Well, uh, the ones I don't need for sure is this one. Uh, I have a, I'm trying to do a puzzle that'll put out the fire so we can actually get at the thing that's there. Okay. So I'm trying to get that figured out. What ingredient needed? A flower, a mushroom, and aquatic. Okay. Uh... Alright, well, we'll see how this works out. Flower, mushroom, aquatic. Does that work? I know what's the most potent version of it. Is that what this thing is for? To find out if something uh, is for the aquatic potent? for the this is for the aquatic plants affinity. Put yeah, that's aether crest. Well, that's aether crest. So, yeah, aether crest okay. has next to no affinity with as like level two affinity with this. So therefore, this guy is okay. So stronger than level two with that. Look, man, I I, I need the other the other ones in my thing right now because I'm trying to figure out which are the specific three I'm looking for. You know, as much as I would say that you're right, Lovage, that I'm only playing this because you uh, were playing it last night, the problem is is that me and Raven have been playing uh, Escape Simulator since its launch. <laughs> we only started playing yeah. this today because it's his only day off. I know what's super potent then. This is either pearl petal or Down. Okay. Has to be this one. Yeah, that is heavier. Okay, so the purple one's Whisper Willow. Got it. What's the yellow? Soul 
recently sold by. That's the soul bind. Okay. So I'm looking for a pearl petal as well. So, love it. How you doing? Too much, honestly, at this moment. So well, I'm more worried about the fact I can't do anything yeah. until you're done with that. Here, you you can have both of the two on the uh, thing. They're not the ones that I need for what I'm doing. I don't know if that's what I need. I think I need you to finish this. So both I can of these what... are aquatic plants. I oh. they, they are aether crest and ocean ocean thorn, respectively. Yeah, but I need to find out what the boat most potent one of its class is. Okay, what class are you looking for? Of, of, I need the most potent aquatic, the most potent mushroom, and the most potent flower. Well, uh, according to the thing I'm looking at, the aquatic plants are classified by four different standards, so. That, that, that literally, I only have that to go on. That's it. That's all it says. I gotta mix a potion, so I'm gonna do that. What? Why are you... I have that potion already. What, the rain cloud potion? Oh, no, uh, but the other one you're doing. So in this order, Whisper Willow, which is the purple one. Pearl Petal, which is the blue flower. Soulbind, which is the yellow. Alright. So now we can do this. Okay. Some sort of dial. Do this. <laughs> uh, yeah. It's not much of a puzzle when I figure it out, is it? Right? <laughs> it gave me a compass and told me where to go. Oh! Oh my god! It's giving me a compass to the most potent version of the things oh my god and that's what we needed the whole time okay so this yeah okay i got that one okay i got that one oh i need an aquatic one that's super that's super potent. Well, the aquatic ones are all in there right now. Oh, I got it. Okay, there we go. There we go. Duplicate potion. Now I can go get the nose. And I'll duplicate it. And then have you grow it. All right, can you grow the, the nose for me, please? Sure. Okay. Oh, is that it? Nosy yeah, so... exit. Oh, what? How do I get rid of... 
of pins. No, right click, thank you. Uh what did it do? It did it did something. It said yeah, it said puzzle completed, no nosy exit. Did it do anything? Did it drop anything? Did it, like... Not that I saw. Got the left ear. Okay. Um, we'll do the potion thing again. Duplicate it. Yeah. All right. Let me go and get the radar and do that again. Don't you have the potion already? Or is it not? It uses it. Uses it. You have to. Do All it of again. the other potions are just permanent key items you can keep using. Oh, you're right. It just it's duplicated. Second one. Now I can shrink one of them. Oh, I picked it up. There you oh, go. There go. I got the big one. Ah, there we go. Hear me out. All right. Episode complete. All right, everybody. Thank you guys for watching this episode. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one. the last one i hope so <laughs> hello everybody and welcome back to another episode pine studios will never ask you for your password guys it says that right there at the bottom of the screen pine studios will never ask you for your password but uh yeah since you're watching this on youtube don't forget to go to twitch.tv slash that ever cool guy twitch.tv slash xc studios to give us a follow thank you very much and enjoy our content and ramblings and how bad we are video games. Raven, where are you? Oh, hi. You're on the opposite side of the thing from me. Wait. Hi. Oh, for fuck's sake! Yes, we're solving separate puzzles today. Yeah, okay. Well, at least, uh... Oh, I have a tarot card? I me have tarot too. cards here. I have a, t a tarot card. It's got a forest on it. I ha I need I need the tarot cards because I have a tarot card board. How do you bring stuff to me? Oh, Raven, try putting stuff on here and see if it teleports to me. On where? On this platform here. Yep, it sure does.
good. I got like a, a hand line reading thing going on. All right, I will look into that. Something about deciphering animal runes. Oh, I got a teacup with animals on it. I got a teacup with a dog in it. I got a teacup with a uh, with a octopus in it. Oh, oh, there's a thing on the wall about reading palms. Never mind, I got it right. That's my own answer. There's another one of that wand looking game uh, from oh. earlier here. I have a teacup with, um... I'm not entirely certain what the teacups are even, would even be for at the moment, so I'm just kind of moved on to other stuff. Can you pass me the teacups then, just in case sure. it's on my side? Thank you. This has spooky writings on it. It says, unfinished note. Incredible. It seems that the elders have managed to crack the ancient spell by teleporting teleporting by enchanting those devices on the balcony. It seems to be powered by the gem inside it. With one gem, we can teleport items between, between the towers. But if we find more what if we find more gems? Can we possibly teleport something even bigger? We have to try it. We need to find more gems. So yes, that this is just explaining the teleportation thing. Alright. I got an achievement. <laughs> uh, huh. Oh. Just gonna ask, you wouldn't happen to have anything labeled a uh, star pin connector, would you? I am currently doing a puzzle that requires every bit of my brain. Give me one second. I had just picked up a star pin. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I, I need those. Alright, here you go. Thank you. Shut the fuck up, I'm busy. <laughs> Seconds later, I found one. I found one. <laughs> uh, if you find any more tarot cards, I need them over here. Yeah, I have not found any more aside from the initial one. I'm gonna figure out this tower puzzle in the middle, I think. that over to you. And adjust the nothing. heights. Wait, heights? Are they candles? They're not candles, they're like towers. 
Because I have, um, I have a candle puzzle here. Pass, pass. No, there's a, there's a puzzle about adjusting the height of towers. Yeah, but the, the candles on my screen are different heights. And they look like towers. They're just floating here. They're on a painting on the wall. Hey, do you find three numbers that are inside stars? Oh, I'm an idiot. Never mind. They're out here. Do you have anything that looks like it's regarding, like, a story about a somebody traveling? I did pick this up. Here, I'll transfer this over to you if you'll let me. No, I can't transfer that over. No. The answer is no. Damn. I don't suppose you have um, a painting of a tower that has three stars over top of it with three different numbers inside the stars? Um, no, but I do have a puzzle that has uh, four towers with numbers on them. Uh, the only thing I can see is that there's four candles here. But with no numbers though. But it goes one, 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 three, two, four. Try that. One, three, two, four. And I couldn't tell you what order it would be in. Oh. They're like in a circle. Damn. Yeah, these are in a row, not in a circle. Do you have a palmistry ring? No. Pendulum divination. Roman pneumo nu numerology reading. Apparently, I found a piece of paper that has that on it. I also have a letter that is it says unfinished letter. And can't transfer it to you. So. See if this note helps you more than it helping me. I can't I send that. Okay. You can't you can't send notes, no. The, uh, it won't let me send the notes. Oh! 
You you did something for me, and I I love you, Raven. What? The teacups. Yep. They have animals. They in have them. uh anim yeah, but on the bottom they have the pattern of the thing I need. Oh. What is this? This one is the first one. Okay. Okay, maybe not, but it is it is a clue. Something about this I need to do. Triangle and square, what does it mean? There's something about triangle and square. I have a pattern as a triangle, square, and like with a ring and, and the helmet. Dots. Okay, so deciphering animal runes. Outer ring represents oh. number of legs. Number of rectangles sticking out from the circle is the number of legs. If there's a triangle facing with the point facing upwards, it is a flying animal. If it is a square, it is earth-bound animal. And if it is a triangle pointing down, it is aquatic. Yeah, I did figure that out. Okay, so how many legs does it have? So then this one has two legs. And is it up arrow? Up arrow flying. So two legs and flying. So bird yeah. of any kind would probably fit that bill. And then... If it's a square with the circle with the four little things on it, that's probably the dog one I sent you. Yeah, but it only has three legs showing. Well, there's no option on the... Uh, there we go. Never mind, it does have four legs, apparently. Mm -hmm. Here's another star pin. Have fun. Woo! I still don't know how to how to orient them, but that's fine. <sighs> still need two more tarot cards. Divination. I don't know if that's a thing that you need. Pendulum? Probably not. At the moment, anyway. I'm 
my puzzles remaining are some sort of puzzle relating to the palm reading of a Fergus Grimm. A set of towers that can be edged that are adjustable heights. The star pins that hey, man. Yeah. Come out here and look around. There are towers out here with different heights. There are. Oh, maybe. But they're in all directions and oh 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 what's that? I see something in the stars. Yeah, I don't know what that is. Looks like a pendulum. I feel I feel like that's what that is. Uh, or it could be. Mm, or the it star definitely pit. is not. Or that could be not... the star pit. What the star pins are needed for. I think so. In I which don't... case, I need one more star pin because I've I only have got one more puzzle left. Yeah, so I've only got four of them, and if I have to put them in that shape, I need a fifth. Yeah, and I only have one more puzzle left. I guarantee you it's in here. But I need tarot cards to get numbers. Which might be a part of one of my puzzles, but I don't... Like, literally, none of the shit... I don't have the fucking uh, anything to make any of my shit make sense. Do you I... have a box with crack, Like, a square with cracks in it, a circle with, with cracks in it, a pentagram with cracks in it, and a triangle with cracks in it anywhere? In your place? Because, like, that's part of the, the box I have out here. It has a lock with those symbols on it. Eight. Nothing that I see, honestly, at this moment. But I have a bunch of puzzles unfinished, so not entirely unlikely. And then I have a puzzle here. Okay. I'm going to explain this puzzle as best I can, all right? So there's three shooting stars coming down towards the towards a tower. Looks like your tower. Okay. And they have three numbers on them. And I think they have something to do with those stars in the sky. But they could be the stars behind me that I, Seven, I can't see. Two. Oh my god. Seven, two. Five. So it depends. Seven, two, and five are the numbers. Seven is going downwards. The That's two. The one. Okay, so it's two seven five. Yep, sure is. What you got? A storybook. Oh dear God. Gimme, gimme, uh, gimme, gimme. I can't. It's Try. literally. Look, it's flying towards you. It's flying towards you. There you go. Thank you. Figure that, it out. That, that helps me to some degree because that's filling in blanks on one of my and things. And now I have a Legend of Zelda puzzle over here. Oh, oh yeah, it, it's interacting with shit that's going that's going on here. Okay, well then... I If I knew what the story was supposed to be, uh, I'd fucking I I could tell listen you. Listen. Yep. To confront the dragon. Okay, a weapon in. he needs. Okay, so... Uh, I'm I'm trying to figure out what which one's the starting point. There's the line with four circles in it. Well, the dragon is the first one. No, it's not. To confront the dragon. Yeah. It's a, a, I'm pretty sure the guy would be the first one. Because he's the one making the journey. Maybe to confront the dragon, a weapon he needs after the enemy is defeated in the mountain from his castle. So the castle's the last one. You yeah. know that. Where does the castle go? Castle is... Okay, castle goes basically in that circle right where it already is nearby. So right here? Yeah, because that's in the mountains. No, okay. no, a little down, a little down. A little down? Like and right here? And just over to the side... So over to the left... No, other way. Right there, right there. Okay. Uh, where does the sword go? 
Well, he needs a weapon, right? Oh. So this, that yeah. would be in the second area. So first and foremost, take the guy. Yeah. And put him in the bottom left corner. Yeah, right there. And okay. put the in sword. Front of the dragon. Well, Where does yeah, the dragon but let's. Go? He yeah. needs to grab the sword first, which would be on the other side. No, no, yep. The uh, top right. A little down. Up here? No, not in the full corner, but this little circle for it to sit in. I don't see the circle. Okay, by down the way. a little bit. And to the left. Right there. Right. And, and the dragon. dragon is going like top left ish. Like more top, less left. Left. A little more left, a little more down slightly. Drop it. There we go. That, did that complete right. anything on my end? Or it, it, yeah, no, well, it, it, oh, he's following it, the path. Oh, he's doing a thing. Oh, right, I got something. Get... What did you get? A uh, self-writing quill. Oh, give that to me. I have the I have the piece of paper for it. I have a, an unfinished note that needs to be uh, uh, needs to be written down on. I I cannot send it to you. Well, how the fuck? Because I can't send this to you. So then we need to upgrade the thing. So we need to upgrade the teleporter somehow. That's what they were talking about in that note. The only other thing I can send over right now is called a palmistry ring. Which... Uh, bring it over? Maybe I can look at it? It came off the, the hand here and it highlighted the symbols on the fingers. Oh, but it's already been used then. No, well, it, that's where it came from initially. I don't know how it works, though. Um, or what it's for. Hey, you said it highlighted things on your side? Do it again? And tell me what the highlighted symbols look like. Hmm? I might... I sent oh, the ring back. Okay. Do it again. They look like... The uh, they look like the... Like the Norse fucking symbols. Like Norse symbols. And you just you put the ring on the finger over one of the symbols and it highlights the symbol. Okay, okay, okay. But it's it's it's, the, it's the same symbol that it already had, so it's not like It's time for you to start destroying everything in your face. I, I basically have. Because there's got to be tarot cards somewhere. Got like wait. This is how many cracks this thing has, maybe? So then it would be one, two, three, four. So four one, two, three, four, five. I 
size do they have? Wait, oh, maybe. Wait, how many sides do they have? So then it would be two. Uh, two, one, two, three, four, two, four. Oh, this is zero. That would be zero size. So no, this would be the first one. So one, two, three, four, five. Five, two. Five, two, four. Okay, that's one and four. Two. Oh, it's four. Gotta be this. Has to be. Huh. One, two, three, four, five. Unopenable books. Damn. So, books have returned to inventory. So these are important items. For something. <laughs> I threw them off the edge and I got them back. Hmm. Lila Owler, despite inventing the repairing spell, she couldn't outshine Laura the Magnian wealth. The life of a wizarding celebrity led her to live in, in seclusion with her husband. She lived up to see her grandchildren grow up and advance her. What is this? Wizard biography book. Is there a character in there named Fergus Grimm? Yes. Ask, I need to know the info from that. I'm sure that has to do with this puzzle. No, I can't pass it to you. I know you can't pass it to me, but... Okay. I do All have... Right, so... Hang on one second while I kind of tab... While I kind of pin up the actual diagram I need to help me with this. Okay. Okay, so... What does it say? Fergus Grimm. Prudent with coin, he was better off than Arthur Bell. However, he was not as rich as Delilah Owler. 
his dabbling into dark magic has left him completely alone. His very long life, which surpassed, surpassed a century, and, and his death were caused by dark magic. And it has a circle um, with a black piece missing at, if you're looking at it like a clock, all right, the num or if at three o'clock, with the hour hand would be a three, that area is black. If you're looking at it like a pu like a pizza piece, like a, it, it has like yeah. So there's 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 it. two symbols I've got that are circle. Well, the, a lot of them have circle, but the two circles I got one is like a circle that is broken at the bottom and has like two lines. Don't have that one. And a circle that kind of has like antenna effectively i just have a circle that has like segments ripped out of it it looks like a pizza with too many slices i want to double back to, to the uh, light to the description so love completely alone completely alone Okay, so that's love life gone, nothing. Well, he was well off, but not as well off as one other person. It is Arthur Bell. He comes from a rich wizarding family. So I think he... Oh, but he left, but his business decision left him broke. Uh... Laura Bagby was the most, was the one that was the most, uh, the, had the most amount of money. Okay. So out of the four... He, there are four people mentioned in that book, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Sorry, I'm reading. I'm still reading. So. I know. So I need... So, there's... I, I know this because there are three lines representing his... Representing love life, wealth, and life. Okay. So, and I need to know how he ranks from one to four in that book for all of the above. All right. Okay, he was second place. For which love? As for wealth, sorry. For wealth, second place. Okay. Yeah. Uh, however, uh, he unfortunately, I'm not almost two centuries. Arthur Bell lived the longest so far. She died middle aged in a garden gardening accident. Uh, grew up. And Okay, so Arthur Bell was the oldest. Okay, Fergus is uh, my main thing. Yeah, I know. Sorry, I'm re still reading. I'm still reading. Still yeah. Reading. Uh, Fergus is also two, I think. Yeah, no, Fergus is the second oldest. Okay. Yeah, second oldest. Second oldest, second wealthiest, and love. Zero. Is completely alone? All right. Yeah. All right, now as for symbols, there are none. You said there was it's a, just, there's like a there, symbol associated with them, because I need that. That's the last thing I need here. There's a symbol associated with all of them, but they're they're all the same. It's like it's like you take a pizza, right? You made you bought a pizza, you bought a large pizza, right? There's slices in it, right? Somebody took one slice of the pizza and left it there. And then the, the, the only one slice of it is missing. Other than his, uh, there's a portrait of him. Yeah. But that's it. Although he did have dabble in dark magic, so whatever wait, looks like dark magic.
that didn't help me at all. Mm-hmm. What the fuck? Do you have a... Do you have a painting with a hand on your wall? How about the giant statue of a hand? Well, I did... I did a... I did a hint, right? And the next thing we're supposed to be doing is that. Yeah, that's what I've been trying to go over with you, because it's the it's the uh, Fergus Grimm oh! thing. So, okay, the hand is the key. Okay, so how am I supposed to trigger it? Is I've tried putting the freaking lines exactly where you said, and then tried every single symbol, and it's done nothing. We gotta flip and reverse that. Prudent with coin, who is better off than Arthur Bell, however, was not as rich as Delilah. He was better off. So Delilah was the most expensive. Oh, wait. Oh, no, Delilah was the cheapest. Oh, he's, um, not two. He's three with wealth. Yeah. Sorry. I fucked that up. I missed, I messed up. Okay. And for life, he was like maxed out or second he place? Was second place because the uh, yeah. other guy was better. And he had no love life. That was how you described that, huh? <laughs> what? The fucking symbol I was looking for was like 69 turned on its side a little bit. No, so, okay, look, listen, listen. I'm gonna tell you right now, the symbol in the book was a pizza with a fucking piece missing out of it. I don't know how else to explain it. You have the chart on your side. I only have a circle with a piece missing out of it. I can't wait to be able to show you the book. I can't wait. David edited this in. <laughs> I'm not going to because I'm going to forget. Yeah, I, out of that I got a thing called the Sphere of Symbols. Sphere of symbols. And there's like, a, I cannot, it is static in one place. I can simply roll it around and examine it. There's a, like a bunch of different like four number codes with different shapes on it. Oh, is one of them a tarot card? With the, is one of no. them a tarot card? No, the shapes are like square, circle, hexagon, triangle kind of stuff with numbers on them. Uh, oh, 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 oh! All right, give me the give me the number with the square. Give me the square one. The one that starts with square. Yeah. Four. Four, and then the circle? Two. Yeah. Uh, the hexagon? One. Yeah, and the triangle? Eight. Oh my fucking god, I've been trying to do that forever. Yeah, the and there's the two tarot cards I needed. There you go. Yeah, this symbol. This thing has a bunch of other codes on it, too, it looks like. So if you see any more... Shit that requires shapes and numbers, uh, this can probably has it. Tell me these are not. Am I getting ripped off right now? 
Oh. I absolutely am getting ripped off right now. What the fuck? Invisible Isles. Okay. It's just a bunch of gibberish. No, this isn't that one, Kevin. Uh, that was uh, Escape Academy. This is a cape escape simulator. Okay. I'm just kind of stumbling around. We did already actually play Portal 2 co-op. We did that yeah, whole thing that. together. <laughs> uh, right now, I'm just kind of back and forth, because this level seems to be a lot about communication and passing shit back and forth between one another. And, um... Yeah, if he has info for me, I he, he neither of us have realized that it's the right info. I'm just trying to assemble the tarot cards in the right order, okay? <laughs> yep. I got some shit about four towers that have to be a r the right height, but I have absolutely no idea what that's what that's about. Oh my god, I think I did it. I think I know what to do now. This one goes here. This one goes here. This one goes here. Four, one, seven, two, five. Four, one, seven, two, five. I have another star pin. Thank you. I needed one more of those. Seven notifications on Discord. That is correct. What was the other one? There's, I know there's five consolate, three different constellations I have to fucking spell out with yeah, these one five of the, pieces. One I'm of staring at like, the second one right now, but. Yeah, um, the, there's one above you on the other side. Yeah. I can, I'm looking at them right now. All right, because I can see them. Yeah. So there's one that looks like, um, you know what, it, like a Jewish menorah looks like. I. It's yes, like candle, but I candle. do know what that is. Yes, I'm just trying yeah. to. Yeah. It's like a Y, I guess, but like with a yeah. And then there's the the spoon for Big Dipper. Okay, that's that second one. I guess there's supposed to be a third one that's over here that I can't see. 
The one to the I, left. I'm trying. I was trying try to tell you that one. Sorry, I, I was focused on getting the other one because I could kind of see the one to the right. Okay, so um, how am I gonna explain this? Uh, it's like you took a Y, right? You know how you make a Y? Yeah, I'm just trying to figure out how to do it with five points. Yeah, but there's like an extra point that's going up through the middle of the Y. It's like okay. a W with, an, okay. with a long with a tail. Okay, I think I know what you're talking about now. That's the one. There we go. What did that do? Uh, teleporter star and a pendulum crystal. So I put that in the put that in the thing. Oh, uh, apparently I have to teleport it over to you. Hi. Hi. We just teleported to each other, yeah. Yeah, I just wanted to see what you what you have over here. There's that tower puzzle that's still Oh, uncomplete. give me the give me the give, no, give me the the thingy that gives me the I need to complete the book. Which Oh, uh, give me the 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 self-writing Oh yeah, thing. here. All right. I want to show you this motherfucker. Open that up. Open it up. Look at what I'm talking about right here. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, Look that's at the not symbol. at all the pizza. symbol. Yeah, that's not at all the symbol that it had to be at the end of it for some reason. I just, I don't know. It's just a pizza with a fucking piece missing out of it. Y yeah. <laughs> oh. Uh, ever bright, repeller, ticklish, and bouncy. What bounces when bounces when thrown, wiggles when touched, glows in the shadow, repels other keys. Oh, there's a uh, uh, flying uh, keys uh, in my area. All right. And there's four keys that are here. Yep. So the top one is glows in the shadows. But you can't oh, even my. get, pick them up or do any of that. Yeah. Oh, uh, here. This is what I meant by the pendulum thing. I have a pendulum crystal now, so let's let me read. See. Yeah, I don't know. It's math, and I'm not Roman gonna... numerology reading. Oh wait, there's Roman numerals on this thing. Yeah, on in the, the uh, yeah on the towers. Yeah, so that's probably what you need. And, oh, pendulum crystal to hang up. Okay, so I wasn't able to complete it before because I couldn't do this. Oh, there you go. Okay. I needed that thing I just got. Let's see here, what are you doing? You're... And then what if I do this? Don't do that right now. <laughs> oh, is it reacting to the... It's doing reacting a thing. Well, it's reacting to the... I know, if you could stop changing the one that's on, that it's looking at. So I can actually read what it's doing. Okay, so that's a one. That's a one. So let's, oh. uh... Alright, green tower is one. Yeah, but it's not like they match perfectly. I think you gotta find the... 
fancy one with the chimney, I think, which I don't know if we have. We don't have one of those. Okay, okay. so let's let me turn this to one we do have. Starting with that. This one is one we have. Yep, that's the one I want. There's also a one. One. Okay. And then sure we have this one, but let me. We have that that's one. Six. Yep. Six. That's Wait. a six. And let me just add it. Five. One. One. Seven. Oh. No, it's six one one. Six one one. Yeah, dude, V I I. It is seven. It's Roman numerals. didn't have right I think is Get that one so this is actually this tower five there we go what that did for me oh it moved the keys keys, keys fell, fell to down. the ground all right we need to have one that glows in the dark how the fuck are we gonna find that one out I got four of them. You got two? I have two of them. Oh, this okay. one glows. All right, well, there you go. Okay, so what was the other things? All right. Uh... Okay, let me look at your... Great. Wiggles glows, when touched? Glows in the shadows, wingles when touched, bounces when thrown. So what? Let me... How do you glow in? Sh how do you test glowing in the shadows? I already did that one. It's already in. Oh, that's the that's the one's there. Okay. Bounces. Throw, throw a yeah. key. It didn't bounce. That, that one bounces. That bounces. All right. Which one's that? So that bottom? one is the very bottom one. Okay. One of them wiggles when you touch it. So just examine the key and click it. Oh, this one. This one oh, wiggles no, when touch. No, that's ticklish. Is that the oh, other yeah, one? Oh, yeah, no, yeah, yeah, that is, that is the, yeah. It's the, it's, it's this one here, the one next to. This, the, one ne the left? Uh, the left one, yes, yes. Okay. And then the last one is repels other keys. Okay, so drop them all in the, oh. Oh, Let it's me, that I, one. Yeah, sure is. Fuck. There we go. GG's! Yep. Alright. I think that's it. Yeah, exit the menu. Alright, we did it. And now I'm gonna sleep because fuck, there's no time to do that video anymore. Woo! Alright, thank you guys for watching, guys. Uh, uh, it's been real fun, and I will see you all Ugh. in the next one. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Go check out the description. Go and click links and follow people on discord and stuff bye i love you let's see who's available for rating there's juno there's no oh, ronan's on
playing Hell Divers with Taboo. Who is also on. Go All right, everybody. We're reading off the bow sheep for the night, and uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow with something. I don't know. Maybe not. Maybe, maybe I'll take the day off. But uh, yeah, I love you guys. See you guys later. Have a good night. All right, everybody, we're going to go right off to the Ronin Ren, another stream on members, currently playing Helldivers 2 along with Taboo Boo. So, thank you very much for coming out. It has been fun. A little aggravating with the Venusaur Raid earlier. We beat it. We didn't. I didn't get the solo, so uh, I'm going to have to figure that out and get that video going. But anyways... Thank you all for hanging out with us for Pokemon and Escape Simulator, and I will see you again on Sunday night, hopefully for D&D, so long as uh, Taboo Boo doesn't roll a crit fail. Anyways, thank you all very much for coming out. Peace. Mm -hmm.